Hi, and welcome back to Beginner for B-Series. This is Dave here. Uh, we are on November 9th. Uh, this is fall cleanup day. And when I say day, I hope I mean day. I don't want this to turn into days, uh, which I've done in the past. Uh, I've waited long enough. Uh, we're starting to get to the cold weather. And it looks like, for the most part, all the leaves are off 95% of the trees. There's a couple that are still hanging on. We're just going to let that go into winter. Um, first, we're going to uh, take the Z-Force Cub Cadet here, and we're just going to hit some of these slopes that you may have seen in my previous videos. Uh, some very steep slopes. I do not want to be hauling the Cyclone Rake behind me on the steep slopes just for the risk of uh, tipping. So we'll be going around in a, in a circle in, in some of these slopes just to push the uh, leaves down. This is also my final cut of the year, so I've raised it up to about three and a quarter inches. Uh, so we, that way we can leave uh, a lot of that green leaf on there, keep the, the roots deep. So we'll be pushing those down. Areas I can't get in, we'll be taking out the Husqvarna uh, backpack blower. And the rest should come up with the cyclone rake. We'll get that hooked up and get these leaves uh, out of here. So I hope you stick around and let's go tackle this.
So this was not even necessary. I did not need to uh, make a pile of leaves. Um, the cyclone rake with the mower deck would have cleaned all this up, no problem. But I wanted to do this to show the purpose of not only how quickly you can clean this up, but also backpack blowers are, are great, they, they are. And it serves its purpose for me around this property, getting stuff away from sides of buildings, places that will move the, the leaves. But I went around here for about 10 minutes and the leaves just keep blowing everywhere. And, and it's not even really a windy day. It, it just, especially up on the hill here, uh, it might be a five or 10 mile, but as soon as you get those leaves airborne, they, they go wherever they want. So what's nice about this cyclone rake it's just leave it there, mow over it, and you've got them. But even if you do have a pile, this is a this is a large, pretty large pile of leaves. Um, I'd say it's got to be 12 feet, maybe more, maybe 15 feet uh, in length going that way. And I tried to consolidate it the best I could, but it kept blowing the leaves everywhere, as you as you probably saw. Um, but it's probably probably seven to 10 feet wide. And in uh, some of its places, uh, probably two feet high. Uh, in the middle, probably a little bit less uh, where I just couldn't, couldn't keep blowing it into one bigger pile. So this is the, the most consolidated pile that I could get. Um, so not only will this uh, cyclone rake uh, it's get the, all this stuff, it'll, it'll pick it up, I'm gonna guess this won't even take more than a couple minutes to just grab it all. Now, what I would say one of the nicest things is I've already picked up what you saw. Uh, we did a little bit of a, a mower deck picking up and then I went along the rock wall and picked up leaves. That mulches as it gets the leaves so it actually condenses it even more. I'm gonna guess that that bin over there is probably a third full from what we just picked up and I'm guessing that I'm going to be able to get all this which is a ton of leaves this would have been a lot of trips back and forth to the to my dump area um, with my old sweeper I used to have a sweeper or I'd put in a tarp and drag it I mean we're going to take this now again We'll see how long it actually takes me, but we'll do this in real time. Uh, I'm thinking no more than a couple minutes and this is gonna be all gone in that bagging area and we'll still have room to probably pick up more leaves. Let's get at it.
Okay, obviously it's not perfect. I'm not gonna sit here and nitpick uh, all the little tiny leaves here, but uh, be interesting to see how long that took. Felt like only a couple minutes, maybe three, but that hopper has still got room for leaves. Let's continue on. Got a few more piles to pick up. All right, so this is uh, everything that uh, those two big piles, the uh, one mower deck uh, pickup that I did, and uh, the rock wall that we had blown a, a section into and then sucked it up that way. I think there's still room to spare. However, the next spot I'm gonna go to is where we talked about the culvert and just keeping the leaves in there that's going to be a, a big job to pick up so that's where i'm going to go do next but let's just see exactly what we got here yep still had room and as you can see we're even picking up debris like small sticks and stuff but almost powdered a lot of it some more debris simply amazing all right we're gonna dump this Hope we can get out of here. Awesome. Well, guys, I think uh, what I really wanted to show you today was the capabilities of that cyclone rake. Um, just the, the two different options of 
being able to mow your lawn. That's going to really be uh, what I'm going to do the rest of the uh, for the rest of my cleanup is to just take the mower deck and go mow the lawn, get all the loose leaves that are out there. Uh, I will go to that culvert next while I'm still hooked up with the accessory hose, and we'll get that all picked up, switch it back over so that it's on the mower deck and uh, complete it. So. Uh, simply amazed that we just got all those leaves it's all mulched up. Uh, this will actually be spread onto the back woods path that I have been working on in my previous videos. So I really appreciate everybody sticking around. Uh, if you like this kind of content, if you like the content that I'm doing, if you'd hit the uh, like button, subscribe if you haven't. Uh, we're going to keep on going. I appreciate you sticking around. And we'll catch you on the next one.